What up? I'm Bobby Shine and this is Bobby Rants. Why? Cause Casey's gone for the weekend, so I'm taking over. <laughs> did I did I miss something? Yeah, so thanks again to Bobby Shine for taking over Casey Rants while I went away. But now I'm back. <laughs> no, seriously, I'm back. Don't try to take my channel. I'm from Jersey. I will cut you. And we'll go back to Casey Rant. <laughs> I don't understand sometimes my generation. So lately all these people on my Facebook have just been talking about how they're going out to drink and how wasted they get every weekend or how wasted they just get in general on days of the week, like yesterday. I don't understand them. I don't have money to go out and get drunk. So maybe I'm just a little jealous, but I'm not. I think sometimes these people are wasting their lives. Like how many times can you go out and how many times can you have a bottle of wine? And the other day I posted a Facebook status and I was like, I think half these people need to go to AA or the other half needs a new liver because these people are crazy. I don't understand. Just because we're over 21 and we can drink, some people just overdo it. But I'm clearly tired of having pictures thrown in my face of people being like, Here's this bottle that we just got. Oh, we just finished it. I mean, way to brag about it. Good job, you're an alcoholic. Let me give you props. Now, I'm now I'm saying this, and you guys are like, well, Casey, can't you drink? Yeah, I can drink, but guess what? I choose to not drink. Now, I am over 21. I'm gonna be 23 next month. Yay, so send me flowers and birthday cards and a mixer. Most of the flowers in the mixer, I don't care about cards, I'll just throw them up. You know, alcoholism runs rapidly in my family. I have many uncles and aunts and cousins and other people that suffer from alcoholism. And my grandfather suffered from it too. Um, you know, and I just worry about that because it's really prominent in my family. So, not that I'm thinking one drink is gonna make me an alcoholic. I'll go out and I'll have a drink, but I just choose not to drink a lot. <laughs> Basically because I'm poor, but the other half because I'm afraid of becoming an alcoholic. Um, during football season, yes, you'll see me post a lot that I'm drinking wine. Um, yeah, because I get really crazy during football games. I get really like stressed out and worried <laughs> because I always feel the Giants are going to lose, which they did a lot of last year and then they came back to the Super Bowl, so I don't know why I stress so much. But I don't have a problem and I know that's what you guys are going to say. It's not what alcoholics say, they don't have a problem, but I really don't. Um, the last time I had anything to drink was when we were away, I had a beer and some vodka with lemonade, which is weird. But the time before that was, seriously, Kim and I went out to dinner like over a month ago. And we got, we went to Chili's or something like that. And they, we had drinks with our meal, but that was it. So I don't go out and get wasted every weekend. Um, Cause there's no need for it. You can have so much fun without alcohol. Um, you know, most of the time when I hang out with like Vicky Chad or, and Brie or you know her brother and his, and uh, her brother's friends we don't really even drink and if we do it's, it's very rare we like to have fun without drinking we like to play board games which is funny because we're like in our 20s but we do we like to play silly games and I we have more fun doing that than getting plastered and making a fools of ourselves so point here is you don't need alcohol to have a good time. It just stops staring me down. <laughs> you, you guys sound so very Christian youth group. I am a Christian youth group. <laughs> Yay Jesus! Who I don't even believe in. Anyway. You're getting nothing for Christmas now. No, but I celebrate Christmas because Christmas, I like the feeling of giving people presents. You would like, listen to Christmas music year long if it wasn't for you. I listened to it the other day. I don't <laughs> Yeah, so, you know, I'm not saying having one drink ever so often. I'm not saying drinking a couple times a week is crazy. I'm talking if you can't go a day without drinking alcohol, you should probably get yourself checked into some clinic. 
because alcoholism it, it's basically will kill you in the end you'll destroy your liver and you have no one to blame but yourself but it just makes me sad when I feel like this generation or my generation can't have fun unless you're drinking alcohol there's so many things that are more fun than drinking and spending all your money on drinking now, like I said, it's not bad to go out and go have a good time. You can, I will go out and I'll drink, but, you know, when you post things like that on your Facebook every single week, you're starting to set off a bad vibe about yourself. So, just drink safe and try to have a good time without it, and I promise it's, like, a lot better, and it's a lot of empty calories. <laughs> well, I love you guys. Thanks again to Bobby Shine for taking over the last two. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and thumbs up if you liked it. And I'll see you guys on Friday. Bye. The Giants are playing. Oh, shut up. I'm recording. No. No, fuck you. I'm almost done. I'm going to throw something at all you guys. Mom. Okay. I need the drink right now.